Hello and welcome to my first of a regular weekly report from the Scottish Parliament. And the last week has been a great week for Labour. We've got a new leader in Ian Gray with a dynamic new team. We had two victories in the Scottish Parliament last week. First of all, we demanded an inquiry into the appalling deaths at Vale of Leven Hospital caused by C. difficile. The SNP government didn't want it, but we won the vote in the Scottish Parliament. We also won a vote on the fact that uh, uh, trained teachers are leaving college and unable to find a job. Again, the SNP resisted, but we demanded that they do something about it and won the vote in the Scottish Parliament. But it's been a bad week for John Swinney and sadly for school pupils in Edinburgh and in Scotland because the Scottish Futures Trust, which was supposed to be the replacement for the PPP uh, building of schools, just isn't there. There's no money, there's no trust, it hasn't yet come along. And that means no start to Portobello, to James Gillespie's or Barmuir, and many other schools throughout Scotland. So it's been a bleak week for Scottish pupils.